tomorrow is the big day. We are going to harvest the honey. You may ask yourself, why is this guy standing next to the beehive 24 hours up front? Hmm, we have to get rid of the bees. And in this hive, at the upper portion, there's the honey. And at the bottom, we have the queen. To get rid of the bees, we use this special device. It's called Bee Escape. Basically, it's something like a one-way street. So the bees will find a way from the top to the bottom, but they won't find a way back to the top. Now, there's this effect or this tendency that all the bees want to meet and greet the queen once a day. So if we insert this bee escape below the honey section, all the bees will be at the bottom tomorrow because they want to go to the queen, which is at the bottom part, and they won't find a way back. We will see this tomorrow. So it's the next morning and now we are harvesting the honey. Here is the bee escape. So hopefully most of the bees have left the building. So I'll take off the upper portion. And as we can see, most of the bees have left the building, I would say. So if we... Yeah, completely filled with honey. There are some single bees left. But no problem, we just brush them off. Thanks, Frank. It's very important to keep all the bees out because if they know where the honey is going to, then the rest of the honey uh, beehive will follow. And so it's very important to just remove them and keep this box closed, I would say. Okay, now let's get to the honey. I take this honeycomb and as there's a wax lid on top, we just have to remove it by this special tool. Let's uncap this side carefully. Just the upper portion of the lid. Okay, if we take the uncapped honeycomb and insert it into the centrifuge, and now we can get the harvest out of the honeycomb. Okay, after having centrifuged the whole honeycombs, we now can get to, to the honey itself. So that's the best day of the whole year. You, you had a lot of work with all the bees and you get this tasty, sweet, yeah, liquid gold. Okay, I hope you learned something today and if you pass by in Mainz, uh, don't forget to taste our honey. See you!